Hey what's up guys this is me Wana and this is very exciting after effect tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you how to create 3D spectral with the live action footage. So without wasting any time let's get started. So first of all let's have a look what we're going to create. Alright guys, let's create a new composition, composition, new composition, control N. I'm going to call this 3D Spectrum 1920 by 1080, 30 frame per second, duration doesn't really matter, click OK. Now I'm going to drag this audio in this composition, I'm going to hold shift and snap the end, press N. I'm going to trim this to the work area so before I start off this video I just wanted to mention you guys that I'm not going to cover all the basic steps so you have to bear with me or if you already after effect user so this is gonna be best for you if not just follow my steps and you will create this audio spectrum so let's move on I'm going to drag my footage in this composition Let's mute the audio of this footage. Okay, as you can see, this is a stock footage. Okay, you can use this footage if you like. I'm gonna give you this footage in the description of this video. You can go ahead and download this footage. Okay, let's uh, track the footage first. Obviously, we need to track the footage and then we place our spectrum. So I'm going to right click, I'm going to track camera, make sure resolution is full. So this way it will capture all the single detail. So this takes time. So I'm going to cancel this since I already done this step. So I'm going to save some time. Let me delete this footage. Let me go to my other composition and uh, select this footage. Edit copy, edit paste. All right, so as you can see, we have all these tracking points. So let's scrub through and find suitable tracking point that represent the floor or where we can place our spectrum. So let me find one, but that looks fine. I'm going to simply click it. And I'm going to right click on this now I'm going to set ground plane and origin and right click again create solid and camera this will create a solid and camera if we scrub through we can see the solid now connected to the floor now create a null object right click in this area or you can go to layer new null okay let's make this 3d and uh, select the solid and press P to reveal the position property and select null up object and press the P and this will also reveal the position property now copy this position control C and paste on the nulls position control V now the both solid and null have the same position property okay let's create another solid control Y I'm gonna call this audio audio spectrum color does really matter click OK now go to effects generate audio spectrum so here we have to tweak some settings so first on the top we have we have to select the audio file in this case this free hip-hop beats and uh, let's change the other settings I'm going to change the end frequency 400 and the frequency band let's say 700 and uh, height I'm gonna change this to 1500 and uh, thickness let me change it to 4 okay on the bottom here I'm gonna change it to side A and I'm gonna leave this as a digital okay so now we have to make this solid spectrum solid 3d as well now I'm going to open the position property of the solid as well by pressing P and uh, 
we have to simply create a expression let's alt click on the stopwatch and pick whip now hold down alt and pick whip to this null position make sure your alt or option is selected if you're working on a mac option or if you're working on a pc hold alt now click away now it's very tiny we can't really see the spectrum so we have to simply scale this up now press s to bring the scale property and we have to increase it until we see this just like that okay let's rotate this rotate to i'm going to select this spectrum let's rotate it just like that okay let's change the position so we can't really change the position of this solid so we have to change the position of the null solid this audio spectrum solid change automatically so select the solid and uh, press V or you can select the selection tool, and uh, you can change the position of the solid if you hold down shift it speeds up just like that okay let's scale this up a little more just like that and I'm going to change the color first I like this blue one dark blue inside and outside okay so we have to duplicate the solid okay control D let me turn off the solid and now on the top spectrum I'm going to rotate it so before I change the transform properties of this solid I have to disable this position expression by simply alt click on this position property just like that okay but as you notice as I change the expression properties this is reposition to where it was originally okay I simply have to copy the position of this null and select this top solid and I have to reveal the position property by pressing P and I have to copy and paste of this null position or to this position of the solid okay now it exactly on the same position of this null or this solid spectrum solid okay so now I can rotate it just like that if you hold down shift it will snap let's see if this looks fine let if we scroll through as you can see now this looks fine so next thing we want to do is I'm going to select the top layer I'm going to rename this I'm going to call this reflection okay I'm going to reveal the opacity by pressing T let's decrease this to 80 and I'm going to select this solid I'm going to go to effects obsolete fast blur so here I check this box repeat edge pixel and I'm going to crank this up all right I'm also gonna add fast blur on this solid repeat edge pixel around 2 pixel or maybe higher number it will create depth on the spectrum okay let's move on let's ramp preview this I'm going to okay everything looks fine let's ramp preview this all right guys as you can see now this spectrum sticking to the ground perfectly it casting the shadow or reflection whatever you call it so let's create a spectrum on this pipe so I'm going to create another solid control Y I'm going to call this audio wave color doesn't really matter okay let's select the audio wave solid go to effects generate audio waveform okay now I'm going to select this solid I'm going to select this pen tool I'm going to create a path 
just like that. Okay, let me change the path around here. So we have to change the settings of this audio wave form. Let's create, select the audio file first and let's make this solid 3D. Now we have to again go to our footage and select this 3D camera tracker. We have to find the tracking point that represent to this pipe. So in this case, I find, uh, let me scrub through. As you can see, now I found one tracking point here. Okay, I'm going to click this. Now three point connected. Right click and create a solid. Okay, let's select the solid and press B. Now I'm going to copy this position property, Control C, and I'm going to paste on this audio waveform position property, just like that. And I'm going to turn off this solid so we can work on this audio waveform and press S, bring the scale property. I'm going to increase this just like that. Let's rotate it. I'm going to position this hold on shift it will squeeze this up X going to increase this just like that okay now last thing I want to do is I'm going to create a drop shadow so right click on this layer I'm going to layer style drop shadow so open this drop shadow I'm going to change the opacity to 20 and uh, spread about nine or ten maybe okay let's ramp review this guys let's see what we have here. all right guys as you can see we have spectrum on the floor we have spectrum on this pipe so you can create your own spectrum with this idea so that's the pretty much it guys you can create your own custom design to create a unique looking spectrum you can use the pen tool or you can create a path or any design you want or track your footage and place your spectrum on that footage so this is the workflow i create this spectrum i hope you really enjoy this tutorial if you really enjoyed it please don't forget to hit the like button and uh, subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos like this one and i see you guys in next time